Hello and welcome back to AP Biology Chapter 3, Water and the Environment. We're discussing the concepts of solute, solvent, and solution today. A liquid that's completely homogeneous mixture of two or more substances is called a solution. The substance that is actually the dissolving agent is called a solvent and what is dissolved is called the solute. So as you can see in this example, the solvent is water, salt is the solute, and we get salty water which is the solution. Now an aqueous solution is one in which water specifically is the solvent. What sorts of compounds dissolve in water? Ionic compounds such as sodium chloride dissolve in water, as we saw earlier. Sodium gives up an electron, its valence electron, to join the seven valence electrons of a chlorine atom, and an ionic bond is formed between the oppositely charged ions. This is due to the attraction between two oppositely charged atoms. So now when they dissolve in water, it is due to the fact that they're ionic. Now, in the case of polar molecules, such as sugars, also dissolve in water. Such compounds dissolve when the water molecules surround each of the solute molecules, forming hydrogen bonds with them. So, main points. A liquid that is a homogeneous mixture of two or more substances is called a solution. The, the dissolving agent is called a solvent. In the case of salt that dissolves in water, water is a solvent. The substance that is actually being dissolved is called a solute. So salt would be the solute. And an aqueous solution is one in which water is a solvent. Now, all sorts of different compounds dissolve in water. Water is known actually as the universal solvent because it dissolves so many things. Ionic compounds, sugars, and so on. 